thin Martian atmosphere composed primarily of carbon dioxide, with atmospheric pressure of just 0.6% that of Earth's, offers little protection from the Sun's relentless ultraviolet radiation. This constant bombardment delivers hundreds of times more ultraviolet dosage than reaches Earth's surface, exceeding biologically significant thresholds, according to NASA's Mars Exploration Program. These intense ultraviolet exposure significantly impacts Martian geology and the potential for past life. degradation of minerals such as olivine and pyroxene due to ultraviolet radiation produces new compounds like magnesium chloride. This process accelerates weathering and erosion on Mars. As observed by NASA's Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter, the photolytic breakdown of water molecules trapped in ancient sedimentary layers leads to the formation of hydrated cells such as perchlorates, which are evident in deposits across Martian surface. These deposits have been analyzed through spectroscopic data gathered by robbers like Curiosity. effects of ultraviolet radiation extends beyond the physical real. Earth's organisms have evolved to counteract damage. Whether similar defenses existed on early Mars is unclear. Could ultraviolet radiation have acted as a barrier to complex life forms on Mars?
future Martian missions should prioritize searching for fossilized microbial remains for evidence of ultraviolet damage. Comparing these findings on Earth-based life forms could provide insights into the possible adaptive strategies of early Martian organisms. Search for answers about Mars's past may hold profound implications to understand the origins and resilience of life itself.